Hey everyone and welcome to today's video. Today's video is going to be very different from any other kind of a video that I've ever made before. And as you can see, with it being dark and you can see my breath, it is actually around 2.30 in the morning and I'm starting the vlog at the end of the day. I didn't make an opening this morning because I didn't plan on making this video. This was just a spur of the moment kind of thing. So today's video is I'm going to share with you guys just a typical day of mine. It's nothing interesting. I didn't go anywhere. Nothing fun or anything interesting happened. I just did some cleaning. I went and got my mail. I'm now doing my laundry. That's why it's 2.30 in the morning. I'm just finishing up my laundry. Um, but today's video was one of the more difficult videos I've ever made. For a couple of reasons. First, because I let you guys into my personal space. My personal space is something I value a lot and it's hard for me to let people in. Um, I don't like a lot of people at my apartment. If I'm really close to somebody, then it's fine, but just random people, I don't like having people over. And it's not because I'm ashamed of my apartment or I don't like where I live, it's just I like my personal space. And then the biggest reason is because I did cleaning and I have video of my whole body up walking around doing cleaning and that's not something I usually share on my channel I don't think it's anything I've ever shared on my channel I don't like the way I look let's just be honest um, I don't like what I've done to my body and I don't like how I've let it affect my life completely emotionally spiritually and physically so when I was replaying some of those videos I was highly embarrassed and I didn't know if I wanted to share that but my channel is about honesty about my struggles about how I'm fighting to turn my life around and if I don't share everything about my journey then it's not going to be an honest journey I made a post earlier on my community tab telling everyone that I was going to be posting this video today and I talked about body positivity I don't go along with the whole body positivity movement. You would think someone of my size would. Um, and that's not to say I don't think that we should love ourselves and accept ourselves the way we are currently. But just because we should be positive about who we are doesn't mean there's anything positive about obesity, morbid obesity. It's unhealthy physically, emotionally, and spiritually. And joining in that positive frame of mind gives us an excuse to become complacent. Sorry, I'm a little distracted by things going on. There's a lot of shade going on around here tonight. Um, so I don't go along with the whole body positivity thing. That's why it's a little hard for me to share my whole self and let you guys see my whole body. I mean, you guys know how much I weigh. So obviously, you know it's gonna, what my body's gonna look like pretty much. But as I was struggling to figure out if I was going to really post this video or not, I decided that I was because I consider a lot of you friends. Even though we don't know each other very well, I don't know you guys that well. I hope to eventually know some of you more. 
If you guys lived in my town, lived in my city, you would see me on a daily basis doing these things. If you lived in my apartment building, you would see me as I am. And like I said, I don't want to portray myself as someone I'm not. I want you guys to see me as I am, flaws and all. So I'm going to try to be more open and show you guys my body doing things not necessarily just to show you my body for no reason but just be more open and walking around and showing you what I'm doing today's video was pretty long I'm not going to be posting any more long videos after today I know a couple people were kind of upset with the longer videos and I I understand that they just happen to fall kind of like in order so I hope you guys enjoy the video it's pretty random and it's pretty boring uh, like I said I didn't do anything fun or interesting it's just cleaning and me yapping rambling as I always do but I had a good time making it and as the afternoon wore on I felt more comfortable and I think that is a good thing for me so I'm going to end my rambling and let you guys watch what I recorded from today. I am sitting outside. I have about 45 minutes to go on my dryer. And then I am hopefully going to be able to go to bed. I'm going to upload this tonight while I sleep. So it will be uploaded by morning. Um, I've used too much of my data on my phone. And I have unlimited data. But they knock me down to slower speeds after I've used 50 gigabytes so that's why I try to upload the video in the middle of the night and set it on private and then just put it public later on in the morning I want to show you guys real quick a clip of the moon because the moon is really beautiful right now and then you guys can watch my video and I will see you all again soon. I'm going to get out of here because there's a lot of shade going on in this building tonight. I picked a wrong night to do laundry. I had to wait for over 40 minutes to get a washer, which usually doesn't happen this late at night. Some guy was using three washers. Another guy was using four dryers. So I went ahead and broke the rules and I'm using three washers and three dryers. I mean, not at the same time. I used three washers, now I'm using three dryers. But there's a lot of people in and out tonight. Usually that's not the case. I don't know what's going on. But there's a lot of people that I've never seen before. I don't know what's happening. So I'm going to show you the moon. And then you guys can go ahead and watch my video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Which will be a lot shorter. No more half hour videos for a while. I promise. Welcome to Tuesday, a day in my life. So I'm going to show you what I do in a day. Pretty boring it'll be. So I'm going to use Vlogtober as a kind of get to know me more. What I do. And you'll see a lot of boring stuff, but hopefully not too boring. So it's 8.35 a.m. I woke up at 7, but I laid in bed for a while and listening to the Bobby Bones show and uploading my video and just playing on my phone some games and now it's time to get busy so my cats were insistent well at least piggy my big boy there he was insistent that it was breakfast time so he is eating his breakfast and yes my cats eat breakfast on the bar after they eat then i wipe the bar down but you'll see that in a few minutes so what I'm going to do now is now that I've got them so they're not starving to death because they were insisting they were going to starve to death. I'm going to, that's where I film, where I sit. Some of you guys have been asking to see an apartment tour. I guess this will be kind of like an abbreviated. The camera sits on the bar. I sit there and that's my background. That's my bedroom and in the back is the bathroom. So we're going to start my day. I'm going to go get dressed. Oh, okay. So Piggy's done. Now Moo's going to go eat some. So 
I open food and the cats sometimes eat it, sometimes don't. I need to scrub my kitchen floor, I need to vacuum, I'm gonna clean up my kitchen first. But first, first, I'm gonna go get dressed, brush my teeth, wash my face, all that good stuff. And then I'll be back and show you what I'm doing next. So, I'm gonna start by sweeping my kitchen floor because I want to sweep it before I run the vacuum over it and then scrub it. So we're going to sweep the kitchen floor first. I know this is so exciting, right guys? The wood that was on the floor. Two random pieces of pepperoni that my cats didn't eat. <laughs> I don't have a very big kitchen floor, so not much to sweep. kitchen swept and vacuumed that stain on the floor right there it won't come up I've tried everything I know and I can't get it there's my handy dandy little scale that I weigh myself on so I'm going to put the window up because it's kind of chilly outside but there's my bedroom that's my bedroom closet um it's kind of chilly outside but I want fresh air in my apartment and I'm going to start diffusing some essential oils so I'm gonna let the air in so it's not too overpowering so that took like two seconds for me to open the window for the cat to come in <laughs> so that's my morning view so we haven't had the windows open for a long time since May, actually. Looking out there. What you see in the room, eh? I love having the windows open. If it wasn't so hot in summer, I would just leave them open all the time. If you get too close, you see the screen. <laughs> I'm kind of like hypersensitive about my cat, so every time I put the window up, I push on the screen to make sure it's still safe and secure in there. That they're not gonna go tumbling down. So there is my view. What are we gonna do now, Mr. Moo? Huh? At some point today, I need to clean the vents of this air conditioner. I don't know if you can see. It's got some dust build up there on it. I don't think I'll need to use it anymore this season. So they'll probably be taking them out soon, but still I don't wanna put it away dirty. So I'm gonna clean the vents and clean the filter and do that at some point. Oh, from this far away, it doesn't even look like there is a screen in there. Get back up there. This is the other side of my living room. 
There's my bookshelf that I built. And then around the corner over there is where the vacuum is sitting. Around the corner is another walk-in closet. I was gonna get new living room furniture, but if I'm gonna move, I don't want to get new furniture and then have to move the furniture. So I've decided to wait on that for now. So, what else can I show you? So this is my little table that I need to dust. And these were my pots that I was trying to grow Tulsi seeds in. They looked promising at one time. No, not so much. They're dry now because I just haven't watered them because they're pretty much all dead. These, I don't think there's any hope of those little ones doing anything. And then I got succulents because people were like, you cannot kill succulents. I killed them. <laughs> and that's a fake fern. That's why it's still beautiful and green. That's a little plaque that somebody special gave to me. All right, I'll check back with you for my next steps. All right, so this is gonna be something else I tackle today. This is a table in my bedroom. There is my, well, there's cat toys underneath there, the cat beds and that, but, and that's my box of yarn over there. Um, and that is my bathroom in there. I'll show you that in a little bit, but this is gonna be one of my big projects for the day because this table needs to be sorted out. I got all kinds of crap, that's my printer. I have a box of my bottles I use for essential oils. I've just thrown my washcloths on this table. I have my, some books, printer paper, some perfume, cords, empty, snuggle, fabric softeners. I just throw all kinds of stuff in here. But for now, I think I hear the mailman and I'm expecting a package. So we're gonna take a break and we're going to go outside. And I am going to be in my chair so you'll get to see a little ride while I'm in my chair. Quite a while already. I know. Then I have one for you the next day. You're getting the nails. I'll just do it. Yeah. No, no, no. Quite a while, my ass. Yesterday when you weren't here, I was like, I told her, and then tomorrow it's going to be here. Tomorrow she'll be back. Yesterday she wasn't here. She wouldn't have known. Busted. Yeah, I know. You too. quite chilly out here this morning. I don't know exactly how cold it is, but uh, I would guess in the 50s. But it's very pretty out. package and I'm back up here now. I schmoozed a little bit down there so I didn't record that because that had been a little awkward. 
smells like somebody is cooking onions and something good. So I'm going to make breakfast before I clean anything else. And then I found out I might play cards tonight. I usually don't on Tuesdays, but I think we're going to tonight. So here is my door. We're going to unlock the door. And then we'll at least have one cat waiting for me. See which one. I think it'll be Piggy, but it could be both. Oh no, not Piggy, it's new today. Brother not come out to see me? Come on. Where's your brother at? So this is in my living room from my front door. Here's a closet. I have a lot of closets. I have one, two walk-in closets, two utility closets, and then this coat closet here. I always... There's Piggy. I always hang my keys and such on the doorknob so I can grab them. And then this is where I park my chair when I'm in my apartment, when I'm not using it. And then, this is Moo on the counter. Alright, here's my breakfast. It's 10.53 now. I'm going to eat breakfast before I do anything else. I'm having four of the Banquet Brown and Serve sausages. It's 150 calories and one gram of carb for two. So I'm having two servings. And then three eggs with a quarter of a cup of shredded cheddar cheese so that will be my breakfast and then I will check back after that all right guys I have you on my stand hi um I have you on my stand and I'm going to try to work on cleaning up some of this mess on this table I'm gonna start by putting my washcloths in the utility closet where they're supposed to be. First we're going to put the towels where they're supposed to go. So that's starting to look a little bit better already. I guess a little bit. I got rid of some junk and put my books on the bookshelf. Onward we go. I'll be back with you guys in a little bit. I don't want to tape too much because it's going to get boring after a while. So I'll be back in a couple minutes. I told you guys this was going to be all over the place today. So I'm back in the kitchen. I want to get my kitchen cleaned up because I want to put some chicken breast to marinate while I'm playing cards this afternoon and it's now 2 o'clock. So I want to get this cleaned up so I can get my chicken out because I don't want to put like the chicken all over the stuff because of the germs. And I have a sink full. It's not as much a sink full as it looks. It's just I didn't have a garbage bag out, so I threw like my egg my egg carton. I threw it in oh water. I threw it in the sink, and I threw just other random things in the sink that needed to go in the garbage. So once I get the garbage out of the sink, I hope I'm not the only one who puts garbage in the sink. It's not like disgusting garbage. It's just, I guess I'm trying to justify myself now. And I don't know how much of this I'm going to leave in here because this is going to get, oh, my ring came off. I'm going to take my rings off while I do the dishes, especially this one. Um, I don't know how much of this I'm going to leave in the video because it's already getting super long and I'm coming out with all these super long videos and sometimes super long videos irritate me even though I know some of you guys say you like them every day a long video is not good um, but I'm trying to find things to fill up my vlogtober it's a little bit more challenging than I realized coming out with a video every single day and it isn't I don't want to just do what I eat every day I did that for over a month um, with my weigh-ins, my daily weigh-ins, and I got bored with that. I still weigh myself daily, 
and somebody had asked when my next weigh-in will be. That will be on October the 26th on my birthday to see if I've gotten down to below 500, which is my goal. Um, so that's the reason why there is no... I could be talking while I'm doing this, and I am sitting down for this because I'm going to be here for an extended period of time. And I've been on my feet a lot this morning already. been walking around a lot, and my back is starting to hurt. So I am going to sit while I do this. Um, so, what was I going to say? Um, I lost my tree. Eggshell. Um, oh, somebody had asked about my weigh-in. There's no, like, I'm not hiding anything. I'm doing well. I haven't been perfect. I have told you guys that. Um, but I am doing well. I am losing. So, as far as I'm concerned, I'm doing great. I don't know. Um, but we'll do the weigh-in on October 26th on my birthday to celebrate. Okay, so I'm going to do my dishes. I've, like, got rid of the garbage now. And I'm going to do the dishes. I don't think I'm going to leave a lot of this in here because, like I said, this is going to be super long. And I want to get this stuff done so I can marinate my chicken. My opinion on the coldest water bottle before. Um, not my favorite water bottle. It's very overpriced. It does keep things cold, but no colder than, like, the Bubba brand or any other kind of stainless steel tumbler. You're paying for the name. That's it. So, probably we'll never get a sponsorship with the coldest water bottle people, but that's okay because I'm not really a fan. I would say save your money. I sometimes I think as long as my dishes are clean, I don't care if the clean ones sit in this. In this. I have two sides of my sink. One is for clean dishes and one is for dirty. And I think as long as they're clean, I don't care if they sit in the sink. I get so mad at my cats sometimes because they are so picky what kind of cancer they eat. And they just like the gravy. And I have wasted so much money buying different food. them to eat or not eat as the case may be. So I got this pack of chicken breasts at the store and I froze one pack and I haven't used this pack yet so I'm going to marinate these and cook all of them, bake all of them this evening. Then I'll have something for the rest of the week. And these are really thick big breasts and I'm a little skeptical because I haven't really found look at how big that is. I'm gonna have to put two in each, two in each container. Um I haven't found a good tasting chicken breast except for Schwann's. So Hoping this will taste okay. I'm just going to fillet them. And I'm gonna use my new G Hughes lemon herb marinade to marinate them in. If I don't fillet these, it's going to take forever for them to get done because they're so big. Doing stuff like this makes me want to become a vegetarian. When I don't have to think about it or prepare it, it's not that bad, but when you have to prepare it and touch it, I mean... makes you think twice a few times.
I have a kitty down here because he smells chicken. So, there is 10 calories and one carb per tablespoon. So I'm not really sure how to calculate the carbs and calories for what I'm to put on because obviously it's not all gonna to stick to the chicken. So, oh, that smells good. I'm just gonna pour it on and then I'll have to just estimate. I used a lot. And yeah, I used about half the bottle. But again, all of this won't be, I won't be eating at all because some of it will not stick to the chicken. And I can put this in the fridge for, it'll marinate while I'm playing cards and then this evening when I get home around 7, I'll put it in the oven and then I'll be ready to eat around 9. Okay, right, so the last thing I'm going to do is wipe the sink out with Clorox and a Clorox wipe because of the raw chicken. I don't like to take any chances. Put my ring back on. I guess I might as well scrub my floor now. Yeah, let me go ahead and do that. I'll be right back. So there's my kitchen's all cleaned up. I just finished scrubbing the floor. I do need to take my trash out, but I'll wait till I get down to play cards and I'll take that with it, with me. <laughs> um, and until my floor dries and I do need to put the stuff on my bar away but everything is cleaned there's my baby boy there's a piece of fluff on my floor already you got the piece of kitty hair on my floor already what you do that for <laughs> to turn this off. I have about an hour before I go downstairs. Before I do go downstairs, I'm going to empty the litter pan so I can take the litter out with the trash. And then I'm going to go play cards. That will be like all the actual cleaning cleaning I do probably for the day because it'll be later when I get home. And then I'm going to do laundry this evening so I'll take you guys with me on my laundry escapade. So I'm gonna turn this off and I'll probably do a clip while I'm down playing cards. Oh, I need to dust my table, but I'll probably do that when I come back. So I will catch you guys in a few minutes. All right, so we're having another change of plans. <laughs> we're not playing cards after all. They're going to play with the other couple that they normally play with. So, and I also remember that this is Tuesday, which makes it Taco Tuesday. So I'm going to, to keep the chicken that I'm marinating in the fridge, and then I'll bake it this evening. I'm still going to bake it, and then I'll have it for tomorrow and 
rest of the week. But right now, I'm going to make tacos for Taco Tuesday. Although I'm going to use pork rinds to scoop my taco meat and cheese and sour cream. I'm going to turn the heat down on this, actually. And then while this is cooking, I'm going to clean the vents in my air conditioner that I wanted to do, as well as dust the little end table. So I'll show you that when I get it done. All right, I got my air conditioner vent cleaned and my table dusted. So now I'm going to eat my dinner. I have about six ounces of ground beef that I just browned and drained with taco seasoning. I have a half of a serving of cheddar cheese, a half of a serving of mozzarella, and then a tablespoon, a heaping tablespoon of sour cream. And I'm gonna use these as my taco chips, the barbecue pork rinds. And I'm also gonna have a cherry Coke Zero with that. So that's my dinner, and then I will probably not check back with you guys until I'm ready to do my laundry, which will be Late, late tonight, I'm going to eat this and watch some YouTube videos and chill out for a while. And I will see you guys back when I do my laundry. Alright, it's quarter after two in the morning and I just got done washing my clothes. And now I have them in the dryer. I'm breaking the rules. I'm a rule breaker this morning. I'm using three dryers. I use three washers. And now I'm using three dryers. We're only supposed to use two. But there's nobody else here. And uh, I had to wait for 40 minutes to get a washer because somebody was using four washers and somebody else was using four dryers. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and break the rules too and use my three. So I have an hour on these, it's two, I said 2.15 in the morning. I planned on getting some other footage of something else, but it didn't go as planned tonight. So this is where I'm gonna end my vlog. And thanks for watching my boring day. Thanks for being with me. And I will see you guys again soon. Remember everyone, don't break the rules. Be the love, be the light, and do good things. Bye everyone. I was going to try to show you guys the moon from my window because you could have seen it perfect, but the clouds are out. So, no moon now. It's hiding. Luna is hiding from us, so maybe I'll try to take a picture of it or tonight or tomorrow night and post it on my Instagram. Say bye-bye, Moon. There's pigs. You want something to eat? You do? Okay. You guys want a midnight snack? You guys want a snack?